Hey, what's up guys? I'm Ken Boneno and welcome back to my channel. Today, we're finally playing Red Dead Redemption 2. I don't know how many times this game has been recommended to me. A lot. <laughs> uh, and now I'm finally playing it. 2023 has not been an easy year so far. And a lot of you might know that I'm kind of struggling a little bit with videos and such at the moment. So I'm hoping, I'm really hoping that this game is gonna be just what I need. So yeah, I have high expectations because I've only heard amazing things about this. As a former equestrian, they better have done the horses right <laughs> in this game. I'm very excited to get started, also nervous. I know this game is massive, open world, free roam and such. So I'm gonna do my absolute best to see as much as possible, but please do not get mad, do not get angry if there's things that I'm going to miss because it's impossible to see everything first time around, especially open world games. So yeah, please, please keep that in mind while we play through this. I'm going to be playing it on the PS5 and let's get started. Ooh. Oh, I kind of like the loading screen. It's like taking like old photographs, right? Old photography and then it kind of gets more visible <laughs> that's cool I like that hmm. by 1899 the age of outlaws and gunslingers was at an end america was becoming a land of laws Even the West had mostly been tamed. A few gangs still roamed, but they were being hunted down and destroyed. Rockstar Games present. Yeah, I did not play the first game either, so <laughs> playing the second one first. Red Dead Redemption 2. I did put on subtitles, I'm pretty sure. Abigail says he's dying, Dutch. We'll have to stop someplace. Okay. Arthur's out looking. I sent him up ahead. Uh. If we don't stop soon, we'll all be dying. If it's weather, it's May. I'm just hoping the law got as lost as we did. There. Oh. Arthur! Any luck? I found a place where we can get some shelter. Let Davy rest while he, you know, an old man in town, abandoned. It ain't far. Come on, come on! Oh. Yeah. Love the accents already. <laughs> Amazing. Okay. So, I'm taking a wild guess that we are the out outlaws that's being hunted. <laughs> Chapter One, Coulter. My God, it looks cold. Yee yeah, boy. Bring him in here. They have kids with them? Miss Gaskell, get that fire lit quick. 
Miss Jones, bring in whatever blankets we have. Mr. Pearson, see what we've got in terms of food. Is he Davy's moving? dead. Oh, okay. I was about was to say. Nothing more you could have done. What are we gonna do? We need supplies. Well, first of all, you're gonna stay here. And you were gonna get yourself warm. Now I sent John and Mike scouting out ahead. Arthur and I, we're gonna ride out. See if we can find one of them. And this? Just for a short bit. And I don't see what other choice we have. Listen. Listen to me, all of you, for a moment. Now we've had well, a bad couple of days. I loved Davy, Jenny, Sean, Mac. They may be okay. We don't know. Hmm. But we lost some folks. Now, if I could throw myself in the ground in their stead, I'd do it gladly. But. We are gonna ride out, and we are gonna find some food. Everybody, we're safe now. There ain't nobody following us through a storm like this one. And by the time they get here, well, we're gonna be, we're gonna be long gone. We've been through worse than this before. Mr. Pierce, Miss Grimshaw, I need you to turn this place into a camp. We may be here for a few days. Now, all of you, all of you, get yourselves warm. Stay strong. Stay with me. Uh, we right. ain't done yet. Definitely getting Come a leader. on, Arthur. Need a vibes from right. that guy. We've got some work well, to do. We ain't run into them yet, so. They both must have headed down the hill. Sure. Hey, I ain't had time to ask. Me. What really went down back there on that boat? We missed you. That's what happened. Come on. Oh. Hmm? Hey, a boat. You need horses? Oh, yeah. Hey, Mr. Smith, get yourself indoors. You need to rest that hand. I'll live. Get indoors, son. Bye. We need you strong. Okay. Oh. Or see. All right. Let's head out. Oh, I like that. Ain't sure to match his speed. That's good. Out here, Dutch. We have to try. Stay close, and we'll do our best to stick to the trail. This goddamn weather. Been two days or more like this now. Oh, it has to blow over soon. Two days with a storm like this. Holy. So far, horses. A okay. A okay. Careful over this bridge here. Wow. The storm looks really good. Like how it's kind of, you know, foggy in the distance. It's really pretty. Ride next to me, son. Don't want to lose you. Oh, sorry. Can't believe Trying to look at the horses. <laughs> he is the last one, Arthur. No more. We need to get those people warm and fed. Yeah. At least we don't need to worry about Pinkerton's taking us in this. Uh, a couple more days, we'll be on the other side. You need to help me pick the others back up. You're the only one I can rely on to stay strong right now. We got a fire and shelter. That's a start. Oh, talk to him? What about the money? Was it a trap? Can I ask about both? So, do you think it was a trap in Blackwater? That many men? Oh, they knew we were coming. But there was money on that boat, all right. Lots of it. Wait, is that someone coming towards us? Huh? Where? How the hell can you see that Dutch? 
Oh, I see him now. You up ahead. Who's there? Micah. Oh, we know him. Gentlemen, found anything? Sir? I think so. Found a little homestead down that way. Okay. Anyone home? Sure. Place is blazing with light and noise. Sounded like a party. Let's go see. Follow me. <clears throat> How's Davy doing? Well, he didn't make it. Party Don't time. Get little Jenny. That's too bad. Davy was a real fighter. Both of them calendar boys is. Er, <laughs> was. Yeah. And Mac, Sean. We don't know. Quite a business. So I'm re I'm trying to look at the horses. You can tell the horses are uncomfortable as well with the position of their ears. Have you seen John, Micah? Didn't see much of anything once this storm came in. He hasn't seen them. Nice attention to detail. Things always turn out right for that boy. I hope. Mac and Sean are still out there somewhere too. Move up, Arthur. I'll cover the rear. So at what point did we lose the other guys? Like days ago or oh, we need to go up ahead. We can talk to Micah. You run into anybody else? I I reckon. We're the only ones crazy enough to be out in this, Morgan. I see your point. Yeah, well, don't talk to me about crazy. Oh, so no, glad you're all right. I was worried, Micah. Look, it's all gonna work out, Morgan. We lost a few folks, but that's just how it goes sometimes. I'm glad you're feeling so good about it. Yeah. Where are all the others? Old mining camp, back up the hill. Ain't much shelter. So, this house, you speak to the people there already? No. Like Dutch told us, look, but don't talk to no one. Just following orders, you know me. Right. Mm-hmm. How much further? Not far. What does that mean? Not far. Uh, thanks. For what it sounds like already, he seems a little bit like a selfish person. Oh, God damn, it's like as long as it's nothing right is happening to him. Like it do be like that sometimes. When he said that, I was like... Mm. like so as long as nothing bad happens to okay. you, it's like, whatever. Let's keep but. it down now, gentlemen. It's just up ahead. Um, no, okay. I was about to be right like, why course. are you going towards the cliff? Let's <laughs> you two lie low on this. Okay. Let's head down there. I don't see lights. What are you talking about? Is it the angle? I don't know. Did we put our lamp? Okay, maybe that was on purpose. Have the displayed in the lower left corner. Right. Okay. Go horsey. Go ho okay. No, you are not happy. I get it. I get it. It's okay. The outer bar shows your remaining health. The level of the inner core influences how quickly your health refills. All right. Up here. Approach the hitching posts. Can I switch between these? There's like two dots on the screen. Or is this just step one? Okay, it is. Well, I hear them now. Let me do the talking. We don't want to scare these folks. You're right, horsies. They are not happy. I get it. Sounds I wouldn't like be either. The party. You two, get yourself out of sight. One lonely man is a lot less intimidating than three nasty-looking degenerates. <laughs> Arthur, in that cattle shed on the left. Micah, get down behind that wagon in front. Go to the shed, then press R1 to take cover. Ooh, it's gonna go down. I don't think they're gonna be friendly. What are you doing? I, I am get getting out of, out of sight. sight. Yes. R1? Okay. Stealth. Hello? 
Okay, we can peek. Excuse me. Billy. Excuse me. Oh, oh uh, hello, friend. What you want? I am very sorry to disturb you. Uh, my friends and I, well, we got into some trouble up the way, lost in the storm. Okay, what you gonna uh, make Oh, he's we right there. Help you, Mister. I got. What's in that wagon? Brother, we got a problem. Folks, <laughs> there's a corpse right here. <gasps> no, I, I just Arthur. need some. There's a body in the wagon. Yeah, I hear you perfectly just clear. Keep your eyes on Dutch. Please. I think you should go now, bud. Oh. Now, friend, I ain't asking for much. <gasps> We're about to shoot Wait. some people. I am kind of desperate. Hey, I don't believe it. Come here, partner. Come here. It's goddamn Dutch. Oh, no, they know who he is. Shot. I'm so sorry. See him, Arthur. Ah. We're now to the outlaw. Oh, this. Oh shit. He's a goner. Well, no one escapes. Thank you. O'Driscoll. Who's that? is closer to the house. Arthur, let's go search the cabin. Oh, oh, can we not loot them? Jesus. Smells like a party in here. Turn the place upside down. A sausage Grab party. As as you can. We need the essentials. Food, uh, medicine, whiskey. Food, medicine, alcohol. Got it. <laughs> Examine. Oh. Looks like the poor bastard was married too. At some point. If we can't eat it or drink it, put it down. Jake and Sadie wedding, September something, 1896. Oh. What happened to her though? Was she in the wagon too? It's a strange one, all right. Maybe they're hiding up here too. There's a big price on Colmo Driscoll's head. Nearly as big as the one on yours. One oh. Colm dead is about the only thing me and Uncle Sam <gasps> Oh, cakes! Eat. Let's go. Oh, I'm starving. You should eat something huh. now. Your health you core drains over time and bad. is now empty. While empty, you will experience negative effects. Open our satchel. Eat provision to restore some health. Oh. Well, well, well. This is dry, warm. We could maybe move the women and Jack down here. Maybe. Oh, wait. We'll see how they are when we get back. I don't really want us to split up. Take everything. Canned sweet corn. I'm Canned fruit. The horses. You keep looking. I'm really trying my best here. Sometimes it's difficult to. Blood. <laughs> what does it say that in the corner? Oh. Because it's on the floor. Right. Alright. Um. Oh, medicine cabinet. Oh. <gasps> Take it all. Is there a way to like see if we've missed anything? Oh, oh, there's upstairs. Uh, <gasps> revolver, ammo, oat cakes. Yes. 
steal it all. Well, there's a guy over there. I don't know how he got up there. I don't see a ladder, so... I can't go to him. Like, how thorough should I be? I don't- I don't know if it's... Like, super duper- Oh, is that something I can take? If it's super duper- Oh, jewelry. Keep interrupting myself. If it's like... Mega <laughs> important? Cigarettes? You a smoker, Arthur? And I found out a card? <gasps> Ooh. Now that's the cold bread. What's taking so long in there? Ooh. <gasps> Horses card six. So is this all of them? Ooh, a Dutch warm blood. We found the Ardennes. Cool. Oh, I'm gonna love this, aren't I? <laughs> So, I don't know for anyone who cares, but I started uh, horseback riding when I was six. Um, and I got my first, that was like once a week. Uh, then I got my first pony when I was 11, I'm pretty sure. 10 or 11. And then I sold... Well, I got one pony and then I we like exchanged it for one that was a bit taller because I'm a tall gal. And I had that pony for four years. Sold her when Micah, I was sixteen. Arthur, keep looking for stuff. Arthur, go see if there's anything in that barn. Micah, you search the cabin, see what we missed. Sure. Then I bought my own, like big horse. Uh, and I sold that like three years ago, I think. Because. Oh, investigate the barn. Can I still not loot these sons of bitches? Is that just not a thing? Okay. Can I run? I am, dumbass! Alright. So yeah, still love horses very much. I just don't have time or the energy to do anything about it. Whoa! <gasps> he started it. Oh! Oh, circle. That's weird. What's going on? Dutch, are you gonna help me? Oh, did he now? He's not done yet. Mm. Mm. Taste my fist! Sneaky Bitch. little bastard. Should I kill him? No. No? Not yet. Find out what they're doing here. Oh. And where Colm is. Oh, this son of a bitch will talk. Oh god, we're playing bad cop. Where's Colm O'Driscoll? With the others. At an old mining camp southwest of here. Near the lake. Didn't know how to hit him. What are you bastards doing? Why are you up here? Uh, we're fixing to rob some train. Gonna blow the tracks. No, I don't know more than that, I swear. <laughs> well, well, well. well. I'd say it looks like you have this, Arthur. Do what you want with him. I don't care. But bring that horse when you're done. Oh. I don't know anything else. Can you choke him. Please. Please. All right. I'm just going to hit him once and then let him go. Get the hell out of here. Go. Where am I? Pick up your gun. Wait. Oh, there it is. Oh, and my hat. I lost my hat. Focus on the horse. And it's okay. It's okay. Are you a boy or a girl? Looks like a boy, right? Yeah. Oh. Yeah, okay, boy. You're a 
Okay. He does say boy. Okay. Continuing to bond with your horse increases its trust in you and improves its attributes. <gasps> now that's a beautiful horse. You let him go, huh? So all the little bastards scurrying off. Yeah. yeah. Figured he won't get far in this anyway. That looks like a decent horse. You should keep him. Oh, Maybe I will. Him. He's already skittish. Hitch him. Here? Get away from me! Michael, what the hell do you think you're doing? What? Ah! Oh, I'm not found in the cellar. Why? Cellar? There's a cellar? Leave her alone. I wasn't doing nothing. She's one of them O'Driscolls. No, she ain't, Michael. Look at her. Miss, miss. Are you... Oh. Oh, oh look at that, you dumb. Miss. Now, it is gonna be okay. Is she the one in the picture? We mean you no harm. Miss, miss. Come on. It'll be okay. What was the we name? We need to get out of here and quick. Come on. I want to say oh. Sadie. Is that not what it said on the back? Oh. Oh. You okay, miss? They came three days ago. It is. It's gotta be. Yeah. Okay. Miss, you are safe now. Can't stay here. You come with us. Of course. So it's, her husband? It's okay. We're bad men. We ain't them. It's okay. Get on. Bad men. We'll keep you safe until you figure out what you want to do. What's your name, miss? Miss. Adler. Adler. Sadie Adler. It is her. Mrs. I... He... He was my husband. Yeah, he was. Like the... That's awful. Like, she lost... Like, pretty much everything. Like, her house is burning down at the moment. Hey! Somebody's Big bonfire. Coming. Looks like it's Dutch. Hey, everybody, Dutch is back! How'd you get on? Uh, Micah found a homestead, but he weren't the first. Colm O'Driscoll and his scum, they beat us to it. Uh, uh, we found some of them there. There is more about, apparently. Scouting the train. Thank you. And that's the last thing we need right now, Dutch. Well, it is what it is. But we found some supplies, some blankets, a little bit of food, and this poor soul, Mrs. Adler, Miss Tilly, Miss Karen, would you warm her up? Please Give her get a drink her some something. warm clothes. And Mrs. Adler, it's gonna be okay. You're safe now. They turned her into a widow. Animals. Yeah. I need some rest. I haven't slept in three days. You're oh over God. here. How are you functioning? Mr. I'll show you the way. Mr. Morgan, we put you in a room over here. Thank you, Miss Grimshaw. Mr. Bell, you're with the fellas over there. What? Well, how come Arthur gets a room and I get a bunk bed next to Bill Williamson and a bunch of darkies? Get yourself to bed. Because I am a very important person. I'm the main character, bitch. <laughs> You're just an NPC. <laughs> Enter pursuit. He ain't been via seen memory. in days. Weather ain't let up. He's strong. And he's smart. God, strong. I just saw the lady's head. I was like, <laughs> Hello, Arthur. Abigail. She did? <laughs> Arthur, how you doing? Just fine, Abigail. And you? I need you to... I I'm sorry. I'm sorry to ask, but... It's little John. He's got himself caught into a scrape again. He ain't been seen in two... Oh, yeah, he was missing. Days. Your John will be fine. I mean, he may be as dumb as rocks and as dull as rusted iron, but that ain't changing because he got caught in some snowstorm. Please go take a look. 
Javier? Yes. Javier, will you ride out with Arthur <clears throat> to take a look for John? <clears throat> You're the two best fit men we've got. Now? She's... We're all... Yeah, we're pretty worried about him. I know. The situation were reversed. And... He'd look for me. Not me. <laughs> Thank you. See, like that this lady's way. head. That was the only thing I could Last see. I know, John was headed up the river. For all we know, I thought her body was he kept missing. Riding north and never looked back. He wouldn't leave. Not like that. Uh, wouldn't be the first time. Don't get, it's a bit laggy sometimes. I don't know. I don't know why. A little bit of stutter. Go horsey. Oh, the poor horses. Hey, I see some smoke. Come on, let's take a look. Let's hope it ain't more Bitch where? <laughs> Sorry. Well Oh there. Seems somebody left. Recently. That way. Sure, well, come on then. Is he like a tracker or something? Like There's some tracks leading to the river. Ah, this bus you. Oh, it's a wood. Ah. Let's cross. See, they continue up that way. You think horse it's health. John? You tell me. These are horse horse will collapse sure, if it's help or if it's help. Let's just see where they lead. So, and we got some of here, Javier. What really happened on that boat? We had the money, it seemed fine. Then suddenly they were everywhere. Bounty hunters? No, Pinkertons. It was crazy. Raining bullets. Okay, so we have the O'Driscolls. Take it slow. Big ravine here. And Pinkertons. Dutch killed a girl in a bad way but it was a bad situation I ain't like him though that gonna justify it though we'll continue along the cliff wall here <laughs> Davy got shot Mac and John both shot too uh -oh. Sean we don't even know I'm surprised we escaped at all by the time you boys showed up from the other side of town we were only just holding on that's a long drop. Okay, don't get close. <laughs> Sorry. Damn snow's coming in hot again. We'll lose these tracks if we don't move fast. So the Pinkertons and the Driscolls are that like is that different gangs? Or war. Because I know I said like in the intro that they were the outlaws were being hunted, so I can imagine it's like different groups and we're all just fighting, trying to. Well, I don't know. Stay out of trouble. That's probably Careful not the word. But, but to um. Avoid the law. <laughs> Come on, boy. Horses are getting tired. Yeah. Yeah. A lot of fresh snow here. Uh, I don't know about this, Javier. I mean, we can't follow nothing. Uh, let's push on a little bit. Maybe we'll pick up the trail again. Come on, horsey. You can do it. Almost there. Come on. At least it's not like snowing that much anymore. Hey look! Over there! You see that? It's dead... Dead animal? A person? Uh... Oh, it's a horse. <gasps> John was riding that horse when we left Blackwater. Oh no. Let's see if he can hear us. 
Oh my god, I thought you shot me. Oh. Come on. Mm. Up there. Mm. What did that though? What animal? Oh. I was about to I ask. That shotgun from your horse. Who knows oh. what's up ahead? Huh? Horse weapons. <laughs> Just gonna... <laughs> oh. Oh. Shotgun. Oh, we need this. Okay. Down this way. All right. Just imagine out of the saddle, it's like a, a gun attached to the horse. <laughs> Mini gun. Wait, do we? Should we hurry? You sure about this? Over here! It's coming from this way. Okay. Careful Whee! here. <laughs> Slide off the mountain. Yeah, that we're high up here. You're telling me. Hello? John? Okay, we have stamina too. Careful. There's a drop here. I can see that. Watch out here. Oh god. Please be careful. No one die. Like it's only the beginning. Watch your head here. L3. Okay. Good now. It must have been. Watch your step. This is real slippery. Stay oh close to the wall. Your movement Up speed here. will be limited. Come on. Come on. My satchel? Uh Oh, kidney beans. Okay, that can help my stamina. That sounds closer now. Come on. Hold on. You just got Arthur. Go can. Woo! <laughs> what are you waiting for? I was watching the can. Calm down. We're coming, John! Watching the can physics. He must, yeah, I was about. To, he must have been running from something since he ends up Damn, here. Cold. And I mean, his horse was torn apart. So. Let's okay. keep moving then. Can't walk faster. John! Johnny. John, you there? <laughs> oh, Johnny boy. Most. Where? Out of the ledge. That's John. We're coming. Huh? Over here. I he hear him, but I don't see him. Hey! All right. Up or down? Right down, Marston. He's down here. Oh. Hello? Where is he? I'm oh, right there. That's quite a scratch you got there. Oh my God. Never thought I'd say this, but it's good to see you, Arthur Morgan. <laughs> they don't like each other, do they? <laughs> There's some beef going on. You don't look so good. I don't feel too good, neither. <clears throat> Freezing. <clears throat> don't die just yet, cowboy. Come on, compadre. I mean, if it's just his face, I think he's going to be just fine, right? I don't know. I'm well, not a doctor. Can't go back the way we came. Let's try this way. This is a cool shot. Wee! <laughs> Argue with you there. See? Do a spell period. Don't make me put you back, sir. Oh, sorry. You all right? I think so. Come on. Hopefully this will lead us out. 
Alright. When is the camera gonna... Okay, there we go. <gasps> Was it wolves? <laughs> John's like, fuck. <laughs> Not again. You head for the horses. I'll keep John's friends off until you're clear. Oh god. Shotgun time? Okay, here we go. I've got John. this. We'll leave them to Arthur. <gasps> All the horses. They're not happy. <laughs> We're getting you out of here. Hey, over here! Come on, you way. sons of bitches. Come on then. Oh, I'm <laughs> Arthur! Good work, Arthur. Okay, let's get going before any more of these bastards show up. That my horse, right? No, sorry, that's one's my horse. <laughs> uh Oh no. Uh could can you Well, maybe we need it. No, I needed to reload. Come on, then. Let's get back to the others. Ah. Right, Johnny boy, you hold on. I don't feel too good. Oh God. You'll be fine. Just stay it's on the just horse. Like a, a dog bite. Uh, you know a fella got bit by a dog. Died an hour later. You I was about to say, don't die. you need like a shot if you get bit Not by a yet. dog? Still crampe vaccination. <laughs> I don't know what you call it. Down the hill. Oh shit. Get out of here. It's Get off. And Wolfies! Down on the right! More coming in on the left! Uh oh. Uh oh! Uh oh! Get out of here! Get out! I'm sorry! You see any more, Arthur? Don't think so. Jesus! You still with us, Marston? I almost Just shot about. their head off. You're gonna be okay. We have some sorry. shelter now. Thanks for coming for me. Of course. That bullet in Blackwater, now this. You had a hell of a time. And Arthur always says, I'm lucky. You are. None of us are lucky right now. If Survive you only got scratched in your face, I'd say you're Try pretty lucky. Don't want to leave a trail right back to camp. You know, we're going to need to come up with a better story for that scar. So, freezing, bleeding, starving. Damn near getting eaten to death ain't good enough for you. Here, let's cross to the left. Yeah, come on. Let's push hard and get back. God damn it. See those buildings up ahead, John? That's where we camped. Nearly there. Seems like we were a lot farther away, but... Did I say farther? <laughs> Further. <laughs> We found him. Did they? <gasps> did they leave? Did we get left behind? We get some help. We need some help here. Come on, help him down. Oh no. Okay. You're alive. <laughs> scared me for a second. Ay, careful, idiotas! It's his leg. Come on, let's get you warm. I guess Thank that's just you. his face. This is a new low, even by your standards. <laughs> Thank you, Arthur. Thank you. You got any other lost maidens need saving? <laughs> Not today. Have you and Dutch talked about how we're gonna get out of this? I was just discussing with Herr Strauss when the weather breaks. I suppose we'll have to keep heading east. East? Into all that? That civilization? Oh, no. People! <laughs> the west is where our problems are worse. Come on, Herr Strauss. Let's get warm. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. <sighs> Civilization. <laughs> Don't like him. <gasps> Just a scratch. We have been running for weeks. We found shelter and 
Been resting here in some old abandoned mining town while we wait the thaw. He has a journal. Hardly the spring I had been hoping for. Can I read it? So what now, Dutch? Uh, we get strong, we get warm, oh. and we wait. Oh. oh, first person. Whoa. When the storm breaks, we move. But we're safe here. We can check the nice tent? I guess. Oh. You sound doubtful. You picked up an opened item. Open items provide half the benefit of new items. Okay. Should I just close it again? We had a bit of bad luck, but then the storm covered our tracks, so now we wait a bit and we go back to Blackwater and we get our money or we get some more money and we keep heading west. But we're heading east for now. Uh. How? Progress. Um. Oh my god. Story? Okay, after Phil robbery, the gang have fled from Blackwater into the Grizzly Mountains, but a late spring storm has left them half frozen and starving. They hold up in an abandoned mining town to lick their wounds and await a break in the weather. Okay, and then we can see there's like a, is that bronze and silver? Kill all the wolves without taking any damage. Take no longer, take no damage during the shootout. Complete with at least 80% accuracy. Oh my god. Nope, that's not happening. For now, we got this. We're safe. Stay strong, Hosea. Hosea. What about you, Arthur? You doubt me too? Never. Good. Cause you know me, son. I'm just getting started. Once we get some money, well, they... They better send some good men after us, cause they ain't never gonna find us. But we need money. Of course, Dutch. Thank you, son. For your strength. It means a lot to me. Oh, sorry. Is it in my satchel? No. Ooh. Oh, here we go. Yay. Hmm. Blackwater. So they drew... He drew a map. Is that like a shoreline? Oh, to the far right? Ooh. Oh. Arthur, you are very talented. Read. I bought this new journal after the last one got destroyed in that fire all those months ago. Whenever it was. Haven't written or drawn much in the past. Haven't. <laughs> Ri ri haven't written or drawn much in the past few months, but I was missing it more than I thought I would. And finally, near a store, so here I am, I guess. After all that business up north and the fire, we spent a few months in the wilderness, traveling down from the nother northern crystals. Sorry, if you're new to the channel, I'm not the best at reading. You'll figure that out very soon, so sorry. <laughs> Stuck mostly in the western foothills of the mountain during the worst of the winter. Food was easy to find and life was good. Dutch had a lead for some land we were going to buy, but the land did not match up to his criteria. Or he got spooked, we were being watched by the law and that somebody knew who he was and we never bought it. And we are wondering still. We picked up a couple of new folk in the Crystalies. Oh, who's that? Jenny, a sweet young girl we met abandoned on the roadside, and Micah, an out outlaw Dutch met in a bar someplace. Dutch seems very taken with Micah, who is pretty hot-headed, argumentative, <laughs> and full of himself. Hosea and I are less sure. Guess we shall see. Eventually we came out of the wilderness and are now holed up outside of Blackwater, although sometimes I stay in town hunting 
for opportunities. Okay, so Jenny they've talked about, she died. Uh, and Dutch met Micah in a bar. So I guess Micah is pretty new to the group. If this is just a couple of months ago. I might be onto something. We got plenty of we got plenty of money and the trail we took was a torturous and slow nobody <clears throat> nobody could have followed us south and east or figured out where we were where we was heading. We was talking we was thinking about California, but then Dutch and Hosea brought us down to Blackwater. Ooh. It's like construction going on here. Blackwater has apparently grown a whole lot since any of them were, was last there. I was told to expect little more than a trading post. But the place is growing fast and it's almost a small city. The town seems to be riddled with corruption, but there's certainly plenty of money here. It's good to be sleeping in a bed from time to time and living a more civilized life after so long under canvas, but I do not particularly like being this near to a town. We're living here, camping outside town, mostly hidden in plain sight, I guess. Life seems pretty easy. Abigail and Marston keeps keep arguing. I wonder why exactly he came back. He cannot seem to decide if he wants to be a father to that boy of his or not. The arguing is exhausting. I hear I heard talk of a man sounded I heard talk of a man sounded like Trelawney? But we haven't seen him for many months. Jose and I are onto something. Something pretty big. It might be a, a lot of cash coming in to do with a real estate scam Hosea thinks he may have discovered. I'm not sure yet. The perfect crime, we think. One where we rob crooks. We are being real careful. It's fun working with Jose again. The man is an artist of nonsense. Artist of nonsense. Even if nothing comes of it, we are having an amusing enough time. It's good to be running scams again. Hosea is a born born hawkster. He's getting anxious worried that by lingering in town we are going to bring undue attention on ourselves. But Dutch thinks he is also onto something big. His words, not mine. Bank money being brought in by boat, apparently. For So for now, we are working on both things and seeing what happens. Plan is to flee west into the desert uh, country, someplace, if we can. Mike and Dutch are planning to rob the ferry in town. They think it's a... It's laden with riches, cash coming in for the banks, coming in by boat. For once, I'm not getting involved in this job. Jose and I are, t are too taken up with our business, which I believe could go very well. And Dutch seems confident that with the group assembled, all will be okay. Okay, so robbing that boat went wrong. Plan is for them to carry out the job, then flee into the wilderness, out to the west the next day. The next day, Jose and I carry out our scam and join them. That seems happy and excited. He's talking again about California, but he's also talking about a lot of other places. Oh. Also, you are very talented, I must say. Love your drawings. Maybe not that one so much, but that's just a sketch, right? <laughs> we have been running for weeks. I mean, running more than usual. The job they pu was pulling in Blackwater, robbing that ferry, it turned into a disaster. Young Jenny got killed, poor thing, while Sean and Mac both got arrested or killed. Nobody seems sure which. Dutch shot a girl. I'm not too sure if by accident or design and seems like it might have been a setup. We took to the hills in an almighty scramble, leaving money and most of our things behind. Hmm. Then, as we were fleeing east over the Grizzlies, an almighty storm hit us. Davy Kalandar, <clears throat> who had got shot and got in the, on, on the raid, passed away. It was brutal to watch and the rest of us nearly froze. But we found shelter and have been resting here in some old abandoned mining town while we wait the thaw. Rest in peace, Davy. 
And then there is the drawing of the map. <gasps> oh, that's a cute train. How did this bring a have been hoping for? Jose and I had been planning a robbery of our own in Blackwater, but I guess that's been abandoned along with most of what I owned. I am profoundly concerned as to what happens next. Next, once we leave this place, uh, or the law find us covering up here. Found a girl, well, a woman I should say. Her husband had been murdered by some of Com Comal Driscoll's boys. Nasty business. Okay, that's the whole journal. For now. I'm guessing more is gonna be added. Okay, so that was nice to get a bit more background because, you know, they are talking a lot about the events that had have left them into this situation, but as the player, we don't know exactly what was going on, and we play as a as a character who did not take action in the boat incident. Let's call it that, the ferry incident. So it's nice to have some of his thoughts and get a little bit more uh, background to everything that also happened before. So they were successful uh, in some of the things they were doing. They had money, everything was, you know, going well. And then they fucked up that uh, robbery and now everything is shit. So that's that. Hey Dutch. You taking notes? Planning your next scheme? Your next robbery. Alright. Can I sit next to Hosea? Oh wait, there's a room in here. <coughs> Hello. There's a oh, okay, that's a door. Alright. What if I sit next to you? By the fire. Maybe. If <laughs> Arthur wants to corroborate. Let's just sit down and look at each other for a little bit. Right. <laughs> I thought that maybe we could have like a conversation if we sat down next to him, but... I guess not. Ooh, that's bright! Oh my god. So sometimes when it has snowed here in Denmark, if you are walking you know, past a, a white house and there's snow on the ground, it is insanely bright. Like, your eyes burns. It's crazy. I guess some of you guys probably know how that feels as well, but so bright. Can we go into the other houses? It's okay. It's okay. You're safe now. You're doing good? That's a dumb question. Of course she's not. She's miserable. Miserable. Mis miserable. Oh, sorry. Keep oh. warm. All of you. Keep warm. Just a few more days and we'll get off this hill. I hope so. Stay strong. It's been a nasty few days. I know. And we've had tough times before. We keep moving. And we keep together, same as always. All of you. Ain't that so, Mr. Morgan? Of course. Don't put me on the spot. He that is so impoverished that he hath no oblation chooseth the tree that will not rot. He seeketh unto him a cunning workman to prepare a graven image that shall not be moved. Why sayest thou, O Jacob, and speaketh, O Israel, my way is hid from the Lord, and my judgment is passed oh, over from sorry. God? Okay. Hast sorry. Thou not known? I thought he was Hast saying something heard that the everlasting important. God, the Lord, the creator of the ends of the earth, changeth not, neither is weary. There is no Okay, I guess he's just reading from the Bible? I'm not sure. <laughs> okay, 
So, John, still alive. I don't know if he's well, but he's breathing. And um, Javier, right? That was your name. I think. Oh, with you boys, because I thought you liked action. A couple of days on the lam, and you lot have all turned yellow. Apart from you, of course. Shut up, Micah. I ain't never seen so many long faces. Mm. I guess, I guess folks miss them. That fell. But when I fall, I don't want no fuss. When you fall, there'll be a party. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> a party. <laughs> Probably. Uh -huh. That funny, huh? Sure. <laughs> Whoa! I don't feel like being laughed at by the likes of you two. Stop it! Now! You fools punching each other when Como Driscoll's needing punching hard. You want to sit around waiting for him to come No one us? was punching. All Micah you, was. Work to do. Come on. Are you sure about this, Dutch? Yes. Folks been through a lot recently. We hardly back on our feet yet. And the last thing we need is to get bushwhacked by Como Driscoll. Let's go. I know you hate him, Dutch. He's here for us. I doubt that. No, you're just doubting me. I would never doubt you, Dutch. You... You always said revenge is a luxury we can't afford. This is the right call, Arthur. Take this. And this is about more than revenge for business long ago. They were talking about trains and detonators. Here. Comb? always had good information come on and you think now is the right time to hit a train now you might fancy living on deer piss and rabbit shit <laughs> i'm getting too old for that life mr matthews mr smith mr pearson would you please look after the place there are o'driscoll's about yeah okay Southwest, so, right, Arthur? Yeah. He said follow the main trail southwest. They're camped near some lake. Okay, oh, I'm sorry, Javier. Let's go find these bastards before they find us and rob this score they're planning. That sh seems very greedy. I don't know if they all are, but him especially. I know they're in a bad bat but no they're in a bad situation, but you know they did from what it sounds like in Arthur's journal, they did have What's money. That? Tracks, horses, quite a few of them. We're doing fine. And then their his greediness. As far as I can tell, the only fools out here are got them, them in this situation. I don't know if it's true, but that's just what I'm picking up on. Of course. On. Listen, I know you don't think much of my ideas recently, but this is the right move. Okay. You know I got your back. I learned a long time ago that you hit Como Driscoll. Wait for him, and people you love will die. This feud between you and him needs mm. to be put to rest one way or another. So I guess they are another outlaw group, kind of. Can forgive, if they have I a few. What he did to Annabelle, I can't do neither. You killed his brother, Dutch. Yes, I did. And I hope the bastards will be reunited soon enough. That's how this will end. Damn right, boss. <laughs> See that smoke? Let's cut up here and take a look. They said it was near the lake, so we must be close. Yeah, I guess that's why they are so loyal to him. They're not really doubting him. And doesn't s sound like they are allowed to. <laughs> Hold up here. But if he has brought them success early, I can see why they would be prone to, you know, trust him. All right, gentlemen. This is it. Are we goddamn ready? ready? Ready, Dutch. Good. Now, Mr. Morgan and I. You have to like head up here a little. An Arabian albino. See if we can't get a sense of the layout of the camp. 
Mr. Williamson, Mr. Bell, you two take up a hidden position just outside the camp. Yes. Mr. Summers, I think. Mr. Escuela, you two hold position here. Let's go. Oh, sorry. Um, do I not get off? Okay. <laughs> Pressing square to get off. It looks like an Ar Arabian. Is that what you call it? In English? I'm not sure. I'm sorry if it's not. There they are. That's definitely them. That's a lot of men. Home? I think so. Yeah, that's him. Oh, I can look around. I'm sorry. Who's he talking to? He don't seem very happy. No. Oh, he's getting bitch slapped. They leaving? Seem to be. Should we go get him? No. Cone can wait. Best to get some of them out of there. And much less fun to rob him and his score if he never finds out about it. All right, <laughs> let's go pay our old friends a visit. Oh, yeah. So now... Don't forget to grab that rifle from your horse. Right. Rifle. <sighs> you boys so be ready to pick them off from up there. So we're just doing this because we don't like him, or was it to get s to hope to get some information? Good. Come on, let's go. That we think he has. Seems easiest to take the same path down as Bill and Micah. Said. Like you said, revenge is a luxury we can't afford. Yeah, just wasn't sure you agreed with me, Arthur. Arthur, have you completely lost faith in me? Our needs right now are supplies, equipment, and a way out of here. Everything else, including Calm, can wait. Okay. There's enough of those bastards down there to deal with as it is. Now, come on. So we're doing this for food and supplies. We're robbing them. Yeah, he's oh, like just already he's talking about faith and people doubting him. I don't think there's anything wrong with questioning his ideas, because this seems a little bit far fetched. Because he also talked about laying low, right? This surely could get a lot of attention if we're also running. Oh, watch out! This bit steep. From people. Again, I don't know. We'll see. I guess I'm just not an outlaw by heart. Did they not have people watching? Ooh, sorry. In the watchtowers or something? Is there not watchtowers? Well, maybe not. Maybe I should take the lead on this. They're going to be gunning for you. They ain't got me yet. No, but the way our luck's been running. Hush. Yeah. Let's just get down there first. I mean, all it takes is one bullet. Follow me. Let's head for that building in front. Have people been walking here before? We just say. Or did Micah go down? I think maybe he said Micah went down here, right? I think. I don't know. I don't remember what he said. <laughs> was try to be paying attention to the horse. Come on, uh, follow me. Okay. Are we equipping? 
Oh, maybe I should have taken another gun. My re revolver? Oh yeah, there he is. Okay, let's get in cover. <laughs> Am I going over here? It's L1, right? So, what are we doing, Dutch? No. I can take this if you want. Yeah. Just make the call. You want to take the lead? Go. Oh, hell yeah. Boom! How are you doing? God damn it! Oh, shit. Right, boys. Ooh! Rot in the face! Kill every last one of Please, my cane do. <laughs> Look out! On top of the water tower, you see him? Yeah. Hello? Try to try to try to get to cover. R1. Reload. Ooh. Ooh, let's go. Let's go! Ooh, nice shot. <laughs> I think that's of my all boy. Of them. Search the bodies. Strip everything we can from them. Are we looting? Let's go, my favorite part. You recognize any of them, Dutch? Of course not. Cole doesn't give a damn about his men. All he cares about is numbers. If you can shoot a gun and ride a horse. Micah, these are my boys. Thought, Move. Beach! Oh, wait. Are there more? I see them on the map. Shit. Get Arthur. Get your gun out. Jesus. Whoa, shit. I just saw R3. <laughs> I got almost two dollars. Let's go. Guess that was a lot of money back then. I don't know. How much do we want to loot? How important is it? Get all them coin, Arthur. You don't have time to mess around. Sorry. 
You give me a loot button, I'ma loot everything. Yeah, I know. Can I open this? See, why wouldn't you look at this? Arthur, sit over here. There's gin and a lot of canned vegetables. I'm gonna be eating good tonight, boys. Good work, boys. Now, let's tear this place apart. Huh? Bill, you go search that wagon there. Mike, search that building. Arthur, you take that building to the left. All right, man, quick. Find those detonators, explosives, anything you can. Let's go. All right. Is there another? Oh, right here. Let's go. I think I've looted a fair amount. Perfect. Oh, there's another chest, right? Nothing in it. <gasps> Crackers, cigar, tobacco. Mm, is this things? Kentucky bourbon. Ooh, now this looks interesting. Dynamite. Hey, this looks good. What do you think, Bill? You gonna well, smell it? Looks fine. <laughs> Smells good. Come on. I freaking knew it. <laughs> Did we get Bill's everything? just the type. <laughs> think so, boss? Found this on one of them. Thank you. This is perfect. Oh yeah, interesting. This is something about the train they was gonna rob. A Mr. Leviticus Cornwall. Mount back up. Let's keep moving. Cornwall. All right. He sounds Let's very rich. Proud of you boys. All of you. Not a man down. Good work, fellas. Not bad for some starving Whee. down and outs. They can pummel us hard as they like. But we will always get back up and fight. That's who we are. Outlaws for life, fellas. Here Wait until we have John, Mac, Charles, and Sean back riding with us, and I believe, I know, they will all be back. Well, you didn't get calm, but this hit will hurt him a lot more than any bullet in the head. Especially when we rob this train, too. <laughs> yeah, I guess we'll see about that. Oh, indeed we will. How are we gonna rub a train? You know, he'll come after us. Oh, of course he will. Just like all the rest. But we're gonna stay a step ahead of them. Make sure we always know where they are before they know where we are. We allowed ourselves to get a step behind in Blackwater. That won't happen again. But what if it does, Dutch? You know, you can't right. just keep thinking we're smarter than everyone else. Let's make some ground. That's how you get killed. You gotta prove it. Dutch. <sighs> hey, you see that fella? Wasn't he at the camp with Colm? Leave him to me. All oh. right, we're heading back. Just bring him back alive. He could be useful. Okay, you got it. Alive, you say? Chase down on. lasso. Can I? Oh yeah. Okay, we gotta ready it. Throw it. Whoa! <laughs> Keep. No! I don't hurt me. Wait. This mount, that's triangle. There we go. <laughs> He's almost he almost You're got away. Coming with me. Shit. Shit. Should I loot him first? 
Sure. This is. Uh, please, please, you don't need to do this. Pick him up. You are going on my horse's booty. Nice little Come decoration. I, I'm nobody, Mister. Mister. And then we. This triangle. <laughs> What's your name, boy? I don't know. You don't oh. know your name? It's Kieran. Kieran what? Duffy. Kieran Duffy. Well, I ain't gonna lie to you. This is a real bad day for you, Kieran Duffy. Where are you taking me? Somewhere you ain't gonna to lie. To hell. <laughs> Why? What are you gonna do to me? Some fan you ain't gonna like. So I'd advise you to save your breath for screaming. No, please! You know, we got a lot of hunger people back here, so... Oops. <laughs> They're not cannibals. You're hurting me! How am I hurting you? I'm not touching you. Let me go! I'll disappear! I'll go to Mexico! You better shut your mouth, you little shit, or I will shut it <laughs> Shut your goddamn mouth. <laughs> oh, look at the sky. The game is insanely gorgeous. Just let me go, please. I don't want to die, mister. They don't tell me nothing, I swear. Are you trying to test me, is that it? Because I will break every bone in your body. My god, I'm sorry. Arthur. I'm sorry, okay. Not Brutal. One more goddamn word. Am I clear? Okay, okay. That's two bones right there. <laughs> Fingers gone. Are we here? Looks like it. I'm just where we we're gonna Second get here and then ship. everyone is gone or Let's introduce you to the boys. The boys. Oh you're gonna love them, Kieran. Good work, oh level two bonding. <gasps> With our horse. Don't hurt me, please. Oh, don't worry. They're real <laughs> nice. <laughs> I'm not gonna, but I can't oh, speak shit, for the others. Yep. <laughs> I got him. Very good. Welcome to your new home. Hope you're real happy here. You want me to make him talk? Oh no, now all we'll get is lies. Uncle, Mr. Williamson, tie this maggot up someplace safe. We get him hungry first. I got a saying, my friend. We shoot fellas as need shooting. Save fellas as need saving. And feed them. Is need feeding. We are gonna find out what you need. I can't believe it! An O'Driscoll in my camp! No, I ain't an O'Driscoll, mister! I, I hate that fella! Oh, whatever you say, son. Well done, Arthur. I'm just sorry we missed out on coal. Oh, there's time enough for that. Now, I gotta figure out if we can hit that train. Okay. Let's smash the train. <laughs> <laughs> My gold. Are we gonna go to sleep? Day number two? So? Stamina increased to level five. Old friends. Okay, do we have um, a journal entry? Maybe? Where's the journal? Recent, permission, tonics, ingredient, material, kit, valuables, documents. Hmm. Let's see. I guess it would say if we had... Yeah, no. Nasty business is the latest one. Are you all having a meeting in here? Hello?
Please tell me no one slept in here. The bed is broken. We sleep on the floor? I not want to do much. But where are you gonna sit? Oh, there's another chair. <laughs> well. Hello, Javier. I think that's you, right? Maybe. Trying to remember all the names by saying them a lot. One other thing. When you get a chance, send someone down the track back to that farmhouse. Okay. Why? That poor woman's husband needs burying. Of course. Mm. Uh, is it safe down there? Oh, just send someone sensible. Understood. All right. Well, at least in some ways he's a good man. Or whatever you say. At least they're not like that selfish, you know? Or bad. I feel like I'm coming off in a the wrong way. <laughs> that makes sense. Hey Jose, how you doing? I just want to see if I can talk to people. But... Hey Dutch. You are a silly, silly man. You really are. <laughs> eaten by wolves. Never heard such a ridiculous idea. Who gets themselves eaten by wolves? I mean, really, who? I didn't mean to, Abigail. You never mean to. But you always do. Always trouble. Well, I've certainly made my mistakes. What's that supposed to mean? Whatever you want it to. You are an annoying man, John Marston. You just shut up and get some rest. Well... You can tell they love each other, deep down. <laughs> no. I'm sure they do, it's just... I can also understand if he... Was there something about the... He had a son, John? That he didn't really want to have anything to do with or something? I'm not sure. We have a task over here? I think so. <coughs> We're gonna starve to death up here, Mr. Morgan. <sighs> Pearson. We're okay. We have a few cans of food and a rabbit. For what? 10, 12 people? When I was in the Navy. I, I do not wish to hear about what you got up to in the Navy, Mr. Pearson. <laughs> we were stranded at sea. For 50 days. And you unfortunately survived. <laughs> when we ran away from Blackwater, I wasn't able to get supplies in. Well, when government agents are hunting you down, sometimes shopping trips need to be cut short. We'll survive. We always have. And if needs be, we can eat you. You're the fattest. <laughs> I sent Lenny and Bill hunting, and they found nothing. Well, Lenny's more into book learning than hunting. Bill's a fool. Unless those mountains are full of game that want to read, ain't no wonder they found enough of this. We'll go find something. Come on, Arthur. Wait a second. Hold on. Here. You're gonna need something to eat out there. Assorted salted offal. Starving would be preferable. Let's go. <laughs> oh you can't go on. Look at your hand. I can't stay here listening to you two. Look, if this game in those hills, I'll find it. And you can kill it. You need to rest, Charles. You think this is rest? Come along. Bye bye. <coughs> <laughs> Gotta love the sass. Jesus. Yeah. You're the you fattest. <laughs> I can't use it, and you'll have to. Oh, you're joking. Use a gun, and we'll scare off every animal for miles around. You're never too old to learn. I imagine. 
All right. Well. Let's head out. 22 arrows. How bad of a shot do you think I am, game? <laughs> uh, yeah, 22. That'll probably do it. <laughs> How are you holding up, Charles? I'm okay. Apart from this hand. Stupid mistake. Still bad? It'll be fine in a day or two. How'd I you mess it up? I can't pull a bow right now. Uh, I sure hope I can. Never really got the hang of it. You'll be fine. <sighs> so... You reckon we're gonna find something to kill that ain't no Driscoll? Huh. There's meat up here for sure. Pearson doesn't know what he's talking about. Now the weather's eased off a bit, they'll be needing to feed. We'll head up this way. Find some higher ground. <laughs> oh. Been a wild few days, all right. That ride north from Blackwater, getting stuck in the storm. Going out for John, that thing with the old Driscolls. You've had a lot put on you. I wish I could have done more. I didn't mean it like that, just a lot to think back on. I still don't really know what happened on that boat. Me neither. Nope. Well, Javier told me a bit, but it sure weren't good. So pretty. I feel like the snowstorm is kind of coming and going. Sometimes it's worse. Sometimes it's like not that bad. I don't know. It might just be because when we go up in the mountain, it's gonna... it clears out a bit. I do really enjoy the snowy landscape. It's very pretty. Oh, <laughs> gotta make sure we keep going the right way. Jesus. There's some patches of grass here. This is good. Let's look down this way. Yeah. I mean, the animals are gonna be eating here. The winds died down too. That's good. No wind at all is bad, but if it's too strong, they won't move. No, shh. Stay quiet. I'm gonna be quiet as a mouse. Let's go try. Hey, stop here a second. I see something. Huh? Tracks? Do I have the bow? There's deer been here. Uh -huh. Recently. I see. How can you tell? How can you not? We'll track them on foot. You're gonna need the bow. Don't leave it on your horse. All right. The gun will scare everything around. <sighs> Weapons. Oh. We'll make less noise when crouched. Am I the... You see the tracks? I uh, think so. Yeah. Maybe not. Focus. Eagle eye. Ooh. We can... Ooh. Tracks are highlighted on the ground after focusing on them. They remain snow, highlighted until the bar and the lower right. right. Okay. You'll be able to track nearly as well in grass and woods. Hmm. I like that. Okay. Eyes and ears open. And I don't know if I need to stay crouched, but. I see the tracks continue over here. Do that? Unknown animal even. Wasn't it a deer? I think he said. Do 
The scent is also shown in Eagle Eye blowing in the direction of the wind. My scent? Oh! Okay. Shh! Down there! You see him? <gasps> I do! Are you ready with that bow? I'm Try gonna shoot him in the neck or head. From Quick here? Clean. Get good tension on the string before releasing. Just don't overdo it. Take the shot. Good shot. Now let's try for another. Punt another one? Attract an animal's attention by calling. This will give you a chance for a clean kill as they raise their head before fleeing. Ah. Oh, I see more over there. Can I even take the arrow back? <gasps> so, are you gonna take care of that one? Or are you gonna help me? Close study an animal to discover information about it. Uh, oh shit. Take your time. Whoops. He looked away just for a second. Okay, they're over there now. That was pretty bad. How is our scent? It's still behind us, right? Yeah. Okay. Well, take two! Might have to get close enough so that it kind of... It's falling. No! <laughs> it's in the water. Get him! Oh no. Stop it! Well, it's dead now. <laughs> in the name of the law. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> Jesus. Oh yeah. Where is he? The first to back up your horse. Where is it? As long as it's in range. Oh, there you are. Hello, my beautiful boy. Let me put this deer on your ass. Thank you. Hey, we did it. <laughs> yeah. All right. Back to Charles. That could have went. A lot worse. Ready to head back when you are. Sure. I just need to finish up here. Follow Charles. Okay. I can see how if you Mama, hold the bow too I'll long he gets tired. Ha! Or he starts to shake and I think that threw me off a little bit. I was not prepared for that. Uh, animal carcasses nice can work, be dropped Arthur. off at piercing to contribute to gang supplies. For a few days. Okay. You found them. I knew you'd be okay with that bow. It's easier when they ain't shooting back. <laughs> <laughs> We've seen enough of that. Considering how things were looking a couple of days back, well, maybe our luck is finally on the turn. Seems to me we should be putting our effort into getting off this mountain now. Soon. People are still weak, and you've seen how snowed in those wagons are. They ain't going nowhere until we get some more thaw. Yeah. You're probably right. And even if we do get off here, what then? 
still have a big price on our heads. This is a big country. We'll find somewhere to lie low. Dutch and Jose will have a plan. But I feel like if the government is after us, I don't know how many people work for, had a for them, but in his hand ever since we fled Blackwater. We give the camp cook five minutes to grab the essentials and go, and he doesn't even bring a crumb of food. Good that we caught more than one. We've only been up here a few days and have already picked up two more mouths to feed. Yeah. One more. We ain't feeding Neil Driscoll a oh, damn yeah. <laughs> thing. Except maybe that can of salt and awful Pearson was kind enough to give us. The girl, she has a wild look in her eye. <sighs> of course. She lost her husband, her home, everything she had. So what do we do with her? Well, once we get out of here and we're back on our feet, we'll see. She might have family somewhere. Who knows? Maybe she'll deal with the O'Driscoll for us. That could be cool. <laughs> well, I know who my money's on in that fight. He's weak, but that makes him much more useful. Maybe we can get to them before they get to us. What is it with the O'Driscolls? You ain't dealt with them? I suppose. Hell, we ain't run into them much the last six months. I guess because they've been over this way. Nah, I've heard a lot of talk about them. Well... Me too. We've been scrapping over scores with them for years. Watch out. Is that a bear? bear Let's see if we can find another way around. Peace. What's a big boy? He must be real hungry. Stay well back. Spring storms like this are the worst for animals that sleep all winter. Your horse looks a bit anxious. Well, are we just gonna pretend like he can't hear us? Are we gonna be running away from the bear? Off the trail. That could be cool and stressful. Bears are quite fast, right? Ah. Oh. Ah, good boy. Oh. Oh, they get scared by predators. <laughs> Again, nice detail. We ain't ever talked that much, you and me. How long you been with us now? Five, six months? Something like that. But you didn't expect this. What? Any of this. Blackwater mess. Being up here? Ah. Uh, sooner or later, a job's gonna go wrong. Nature of life. I just thought you might have moved on by now. You want me to move on? No. No, not at all. I just... I know you could run it alone, no problem. I did that for a long time. I'm done with it. Always wondering if someone's gonna kill you in your sleep. Mm. I still wonder that most nights. <laughs> I reckon you're okay. This suits me. Sure, I could fall in with another gang, but Dutch. You know, Dutch is different. Oh, yes. Dutch is certainly different. He treats me fair. Most of you do. And for a fellow with a black father and an Indian mother, that ain't normally the case. Well, you see. We need you now. More than ever. Good. And how long have you been with these boys? Why ain't you run off? Me? Oh. 20 years, something like that. What? Since I was a boy. Holy 20 hell. years. Yeah. He taught me to read. John, too. He taught me a few other things, him and Hosea. Hmm. <laughs> I'm sure. Dutch saved me. I see. Saved most of us. Family. That's why we need to stick by him through this. He always sees us right. I can see how if How's that some horse? of them been together He's for right. 20 years, it's... He'll do for now. It makes I sense why they're so loyal. Me take time the other night. She's a strong one. It's been as hard on the horses as on the rest of us. I don't know what Dutch would do if something happened to the Count. Mm. Same with Bill and Brown Jack. He's a drunk, miserable bastard, but he loves that horse. Huh. 
I hope they all make it. I tried to ride the cow once. Fuck me faster than a bull. Won't take nobody but him. <laughs> That's one loyal horse. Loyal. How did I say that? Loyal? Loyal horse. Whoa! I'm gonna hitch time over here. Well, wow, Pearson. Oh, my horse is. Nope. Come on, let's get these over to Pearson. Oh, and, uh, thank you for showing me how to use the bow properly. I only showed you a little. Nope. He pooping. Takes a lifetime of practice to master. Well, well, well. <clears throat> Look at, oh just drop it down in here <laughs> Arthur Jeez. Uh where? In here? Here you go. Bring it over then. What a surprise. Find a <laughs> just camp walks up on the table. In the kitchen. Is that any way to greet an old friend? I feel like we haven't spoken for days. I do my utmost to avoid you. Oh, he loves oh me God. really. It's his sad way of showing affection. No, it isn't. Now shoot, get lost. Well. Uh, yeah. See you gents later. See, you got on just fine. Charles is a wonder. Have a drink, boys. You earned it. Jesus, what is that? Navy rum, sir. It's the only thing. The only thing. <laughs> Keeps you sane, it does. Yes. Oh. Seems to have done a treat on you. You go rest that hand, Charles. I'll be fine in a few days. You mind helping me with the skinning, Mr. Morgan? It's easier if we do it together. Do I get to skin you? <laughs> <laughs> You're always one with the jokes, aren't you? Come on. That's really That's the why we love him. Burn hand. I'll see you both later. You skinned oh, you that burned one, it. Did you dumped on the floor there. All right. Oh, really? Oh, okay. Huh. Not too bad, Mr. Morgan. Yeah. Ta -da. <laughs> they always said you were a butcher. You know, you could trade these or sell these in pretty much any town. If you're looking to make a legitimate bit of money, of course. Right now, I'm just looking to get off this mountain alive. Well, okay. if you catch anything else, you bring it to me. Sure. <laughs> Thank you, Mr. Morgan. Heck, Arthur Morgan's first decent bit of hunting after all these years. <laughs> yeah. Well, we're on the run now. Everyone's got to do their bit to survive. Just make a good stew. Folk need it. It's been a tough few days. <sighs> a few days later, you've unlocked the Master Hunter Challenge. Check your log for more information, right? It's been a bad few weeks, but Dutch. Being Dutch, he is busy making plans, and Dutch being Dutch, those plans involve robbery and dreams. Mm -hmm. Who the hell is Leviticus Cornwall? Well, I thought you was reading him his last rites. Now I see you're introducing him to your other passion. I'll mind you to show me some respect, Mr. Morgan. Mind away, Reverend. You still oh, here then? I owe you. Yeah. And you'll pay me. But for the moment, just rest. Arthur. I think it's time for the train. train. Choo -choo. Want me to come? Of course I do, but look at you. I was always ugly, Dutch. <laughs> I was about to say you were ugly. Lie <laughs> still, son. Well, Abigail. Jackie. The boy wanted to see you, John. He's seen me now. Or what's left of me. What about you? Guess I was hoping to see a corpse. Oh, <laughs> stop time. it. You'll see plenty of them. You're a rotten man, John Marston. He is an idiot, Abigail. We all know it. <laughs> now, railway man. Bill, now stupid. you ride ahead and set the charge at the water tower just before the tunnel. Ain't a problem. Why are we doing this? The weather's breaking. We could leave. I, I thought we was lying low. Yeah. yeah. Come on. What do you want from me, Jose? I just don't want any more folks to die, Dutch. We're living, Hosea. We're living. Look at me. We're living. Even you. For now. But we need money. Everything we have is in Blackwater. 
You fancy heading back there? No. Listen, Dutch, I ain't trying to undermine you. I just... I just want to stick to the plan, which was to lie low, then head back out west. Now, suddenly we're about to rob a train. That's what, what I was saying. What choice have we got? Leviticus Cornwall's no joke, <laughs> Dutch. Well, who is Leviticus Cornwall? You know, he's a big railway magnet, sugar dealer, oil man. Well, how good for so him. He is rich. Sounds yeah. like he has more than enough to share. Dutch! Gentlemen, it is time to make something of ourselves. Get your horses ready. We have a train to rob. Let's go. Not that I think it's a good idea, but Everyone hell yeah, we're doing it. <laughs> All right, let's head out. Woohoo! Gang, gang, gang. <laughs> So kindly provided to us by the O'Driscolls, the train will be coming north from Big Valley. We're gonna pick it off after it crosses the border into the Grizzlies. There's a raised spot there that should give us good vantage. Charles, you'll keep lookout for any outriders. How's that hand, by the way? I'll be fine. Good. I'll take the driver and engineer, then run point. Lenny and Javier, you two take the front cars deal with any guards. Arthur and Micah, you head straight for the back. That's what we're after. Mr. Cornwall's private car. You and me, Morgan. Great. Have you got a problem with that? Not if you keep your head for once. You worry about yourself, huh? Enough! <laughs> after Bill Boys. blows the tracks, we're gonna need to move fast. Is everyone clear on what they're doing? Yep. Crystal. Yes, boss. Good. Now, come on! Let's ride! Yeah, gotta say, from going... Going from... Ro gonna... What am I saying? <laughs> going from laying low, with the plans to lay low, then to... Let's rob a train! This doesn't seem like the best plan. We're definitely gonna draw some attention to ourselves. The sun is hitting. Oh, God. Javier Escuela, and what about young Lenny here? Always the first man on his horse. Just happy we're back at him, Dutch. You sure you're ready for this, kid? Of course I'm ready. Just stay calm. Keep your eyes sharp. That goes for all of you. No mistake. Wow. Not again. So we do this, then we go back to Blackwater to collect. How many times you gonna ask the same question, Micah? <laughs> That's a lot of damn money to leave sitting You're dumb. too long. Dum dum. It would be crazy to go back there now. The place will be swarming with Pinkertons. We go back when I say we go back, and that's the end of it. The money's safe. You'll just have to trust me. And if the O'Driscolls are right, there'll be a stack of railroad bonds on this train. Good money. Once we work out how to cash them. Now everyone, shut up and get your mind on the job at hand. Come on. I'm like trying to listen to what they're saying, but I'm also trying to take in the view. Holy hey, hell! Here's the water tower. Hold up here on the ridge. My god. Can't imagine what the game looks like on PC. I don't my PC is not powerful oh. enough to run this. At all. But like, holy. Tranquilo. Wow. Is Bill there? Yeah. 
You want to head down? See how he's getting on? Okay. Just letting my horse take a poop. My god. Gorgeous. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Wait, where, where, Bill? Oh, follow the yellow dot. How you getting on? Yeah, yeah, I'm okay. You sure? Of course. Can I help a little? <laughs> All right. Go ahead and set up the detonator by those rocks over there. Okay, sure. Now just unspool the wire and then attach it to said detonator. Right. I think I got it. It's the thing over there, right? With the handle. Is that a bear? He's coming back to get us. Oop. Why do I feel like this is not gonna work? Okay. This is good. <laughs> it's because I All did right. it. That should do it. I set you it up. Head back up to the others. I got it from here. All right. Stay safe. All right, boy. Don't get blown up. Oh, you're getting impatient. Stop it. We're all good here. Head back up there. Yeah, 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 yeah. Let me look. Wow. I can't wait to just go and explore. And remember the plan. All of you. No mistakes. How much you want to bet it's gonna go real wrong? All fine. We'll soon find out. Everything okay? I think so. I think so. Yeah. <laughs> okay, cover your faces. Fingers Train crossed. Be here and Ooh. <gasps> Wait. Huh? Cover our faces. Oh. Ooh. A minute now. Oh, I don't think I did it. Oh, there we go. <gasps> choo choo choo. Gentlemen. It's time. Here it comes. It is time. Good luck, all of you. You all know what to do. Make it go boom. Here we go. It's not gonna work, is it? Where told you! I told you! Said it was fine. It was my fault. Come on! How's it my fault? You know that? Dutch. How is it my fault? Well, look, maybe it is. Uh, Here we go! Here we go! Whoa! Whoa. Oh no! Javier! Help! Oh god, pick him up! Who is it? Down here! Oh, it's Lenny. Oh, shit! Grab him! I got you. Now stop yelling! Arthur, help me! Ooh. Yeah, you're okay. Whoa! Let's go down. Look at this! Where's Javier? He's he done goofed it. The others will get him. Let's go! Whoop! Come on, we need to stop this train. Whoa! Are we just rubbing? Oh, there's wait. another guard up ahead. You want me to take him? Arthur? Yes, you go. Okay. You go. I don't want to do it. Am I supposed to help him? Should <laughs> I just want to. Sure. Should we loot? Okay, stop it. Just walk. Let's keep moving. Oh shit, back up. 
Well, maybe we don't loot. <laughs> I'm sorry, Lenny! Hey, 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 hey! Okay, let's try this again. Okay. I have one for you, too! Oh, shit. Got him. Good shoot, kid. I can see now why the old Driscoll's brought so many boys up here for this. Marker, get over here. I'm coming. Can I just loot one guy? <laughs> Please. <laughs> I am the loot queen. You all two right. all right? Yes, let's get the money and go. We got some fellas holed up in this last car. Yes. Lenny only yes. died what once, I promise. What are you planning on doing in there? Listen to me. <laughs> we don't want to kill any of you. Any more of you. <laughs> I give you my word, but trust me, we will. I work for Leviticus Corps. Come on, boys. We got our orders. Okay. You asked for it. We ain't Five, opening this door. Four. Three, two, one. What is the plan exactly? Seems our friends have gone deaf. Wake him up a little! No, no! That's an 
Listen up! Mr. Williamson, give Mr. Morgan and Mr. Smith some dynamite. You two boys go blow that door open. Oh, yay. Take the... Oh, okay. <laughs> now, it don't matter too much to us, but you boys in there might want to take a step back. Seems good enough. Now Here light the fuse. Go, 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 go. Now it's tempting Unless to just stand there. Not step back, fellas. <laughs> Take the horses. All right. Oh, sorry. Just walk on out here. We don't want to kill you. <laughs> my, oh we just want to rob your boss. Get on but we are. Search that train. <laughs> Be on the train, Arthur. Look at this place. <laughs> My like God. Now I've seen everything. That's fancy. Well, you got the safe? I'll search the rest. Oh, yes. Should be easy as cake. <sighs> You're just gonna stand there, kid. Pour me some brandy, will ya? I'm parched. Shut up. Me and Arthur did all the work. Yeah, Here is Cornwall. We are yet to receive payment of $2,000 for the He's initial keen. phase of that. exploration at the Wapiti Indian Reservation okay. and, and Barino. As agreed in the open. contract between Cornwall so. and Char and the uh, Leland Oil Development Company dated uh, November 9th at 1898. On receipt of funds, we will proceed with purchase two or three projects and present you uh, with a detailed report uh, of our there. findings within the See? month. Yours respectfully. That's how it's done. Hey. Shit. Just a pile of papers. Bond? I don't think so. Here. Make yourself useful. At least we all know you can read. <laughs> Give me those. Okay, so we're just finding Railroad um, alcohol. Contracts, invoices, Dear blah, Leviticus, blah, thank you for blah, the telegram and anything. for your continued Not interest really. in the Jameson sugar Mining Company. However, any West news Andy? you have received a of, of mismanagement or financial Some difficulties at the mine in Ens Ensburg are <laughs> simply fake, I and I would urge you to question your sources. The coal industry is quite different from the oil industry in a number of ways, so I certainly remain open to a business meeting at your convenience you to exchange ideas and educate each other on our respective areas of corporate expertise. I would also be delighted to host you in Ansberg and give you a personal tour of the mine and its associated facilities. I look forward to further course. Nothing much yet. I'm finding paper to read, okay? Well, let's keep looking. Oh. Goddamn O'Driscolls. Cigarettes. These just seem to be contracts. Arthur, have you looked down the end there? Um. <sighs> well, keep looking. There must be something. Yeah. What you want to bet? There's no, no money. This looks like some. No money at there? all. A little bit of money. Bond. James Think Bond. Nice. Thank God. Come on. Can't take any more cigars. Is there? No. All right. Well, I don't think it's necessarily what the. What did you buy? These. Want it? Bonds. They worth anything? Oh, sure. Bearer bonds. I think we can probably sell these pretty easily. Well done. Now, would you get rid of all of this? The train? Yeah. Get it out of here. What about them? What do you think? I don't know. <laughs> it's up to you. Kill them, leave them here, take them with you on the train. Just make sure they don't send no folk after us. Okay. See you back at camp. When you get back, we'll be moving on. The rest of you, let's ride. Why is it always up to me? Okay, get on the train, quick, all of you. Any bright all ideas, three. I kill all three. So behave. Get in. Come on, move. Get in. I'm gonna tell a soul, I swear. 
And get in the train! <laughs> Warning shots. Okay, do I have my horse? Yep. I do not wish to run all the way up here. Go. All right, start the train. Did you take off your mask? I sure as hell didn't. Oh, for Lord's sake! Put that book away and go help! <laughs> Stop reading. So we getting out of this hellhole? We're gonna try. Weather seems stable. And we just robbed the Leviticus Cornwall train. We got money in our pockets. The worst is behind us, gentlemen. So the question uh, is, where now? I know this country a little. I told you, we should set up camp in Horseshoe Overlook near Valentine. We'll be able to hide out there no problem, as long as we keep our noses clean. Well, then let's go. Clean noses and everything <laughs> John. else. John. Arthur, you're in Poor that thing. one. Bring Hosea. I know you two like to talk about the good old days and what's gone wrong with old Dutch. Oh, we sure do. We spill the tea. I don't know why Mike, the game is stuttering. Micah, get over here! Yes, boss. You two ride up ahead. Make sure there's no surprises. We've had <laughs> Look of funny. Those. Me with the boy? <laughs> Just Sorry. go. Come on, kid. You can buy me a whiskey. <laughs> Damn chill. Oh my god. This game is breathtaking. And a waterfall too. Get us out oh. the street. Oh. Oh no. The wheel. Keep us moving, but calm. The calm. Oh, oh no. Shit. Whoops. Okay. Let's take a look. You all right back there? Does everything look all right? Well, what's going on? Ah, I broke the goddamn wheel. All right. <laughs> goddamn. You need help? I reckon we can handle it. All right, Charles, you and me hold the thing up while you try and put the wheel back on, Arthur. You still strong enough to hold up a wig? Shut up. I'm just saying. Don't say less. Pick the wheel up. I'm trying. Good joint. Dislocate your shoulder. There we go. I think it's good. See? You ain't so useless after all. <laughs> Not quite. 
That's what happens when I drive. I am so unlucky when it comes to cars. Oh. What it? What do you think? If they wanted trouble, we wouldn't have seen them. Right. Poor Good bastards. Point. We really screwed them over down here. Come on, let's not push our luck. What happened? Well, get in. I'll tell you. I really like Charles. Not I really do. Now. And Hosea. I like all of them, except Micah and we'll Dutch. The river, then cut left inland. At least so far. We'll see if they can Why redeem themselves. So, so, yes. The Indians in these parts got sold a very raw deal. This is the heartlands we're going to. Good farming and grazing country. They lost it all. Stolen clean away from them it was. Every blade of grass. Killed or herded up to the reservations in the middle of nowhere. And how's that different from anywhere else? Well, maybe it's not. I just heard some of the army out here was particularly uh, unpleasant about it. Mm. Unpleasant? How do you rob and kill people pleasantly? We don't, in spite of Dutch's talk. I fear I was perhaps trying to simplify something more complicated for the benefit of our block-headed driver here. Hey, don't blame it on me. Never forget, this here's a con man, Charles, born and bred. Just because it sounds fancy don't mean he knows a damn thing about what he's talking about. True. So, what happened to your tribe? I don't even know if I have one. At least, not that I can remember. My father was a colored man. He told me he lived with our people for a while. A number of free men did, but when we were forced to move from our lands, the three of us fled. I was too young to really remember much. My whole life I've been on the run. A couple years later, some soldiers captured my mother. Took her somewhere. We never saw her again. We drifted yeah, around. He was a very sad man, and the drink had a mean hold on him. Around 13, I just took off on my own. That was about the age we found young Arthur here. Maybe a little older. A wilder delinquent you never did see. But he learned fast. Not as fast as Marston, apparently. <laughs> Wait, I don't understand. What's the problem between you two? Yeah. Arthur? Uh, it's a long story. We still heading the right way? That depends. Are we still heading west in search of fortune and repose in virgin forests as we planned? No. Are we heading you are in now the hot. Well, direction <laughs> on our desperate escape from the law eastwards down the mountains? Yes, I believe so. Can you know this for the Hello? environment. I've been through a couple of times. There's a livestock town not too far from here called Valentine. Cowboys, outlaws, working girls, our kind of place. The Driscolls? Probably them too. Pinkertons? Let's hope not. And this place we're going. Wait, well, what's it called again? Horseshoe Overlook. It's a good place to lie low. It'll do for now. And how low do you think Dutch is really going to lie? <laughs> it's just, you know, maybe it's me who's changed, not him, but... We kept telling him that ferry job didn't feel right. You and me had a real lead in Blackwater that could have worked out. Maybe. It just isn't like Dutch to lose his head like that. Things go wrong sometimes. People die. It's the way it is. Always has been. Me, you, Dutch. We've all been in this line of work a long time. And we're still here, so... Well, I figure we must have got it right a hell of a lot more than we got it wrong. Yeah, I mean... What is he? What are you, what are you making? Working on there, anyway? Just some yarrow and ginseng. Good for the health. Better than that stuff you buy in the store. Yeah, you can have all this. I'm at the point where I can do it with my eyes closed. Well, thank okay. you. Thank you. Some herbs, these can be consumed to replenish your cores, used in cooking, or to craft items. Okay. 
A variety of plants can be found throughout the world. Pick them to learn about their properties. Oh, oh, we need to make a turn here. Bleh. Compendium, compendium tracks what you have discovered in the world. It can be accessed in the progress. So, yes, okay. We saw that earlier. Alrighty. But yeah, they talked about that with uh, the thing about Dutch, and I feel like it's uh, greediness, like always wanting more, that kind of gets yep. or got them in this situation. Because it sounded like they were doing fine, right? And then he wanted more. He wanted more money because then they could buy some land or, you know, go somewhere new. And it messed them up in the end. I feel like we're going quite fast right now. I'm so excited to go and explore, maybe go and visit some towns and stuff like that because the world is really gorgeous. I don't know if there's some graphical settings on the PlayStation. Because we might have to favor resol not resolution, uh, performance maybe because there's like a few stutter. Head in there, follow the track for a bit. Who's talking? Thanks. Hey, slow up. Oh, there, by the rock. Okay. Oh, sorry. Uh, slow down. You coming? <laughs> okay, let's go. All right. We're Any going through the bush. In here, Javier? Nope. It went well. This is a good spot. Excellent. All right. I think this will work for us, Arthur. For now, anyway. Hope so. Good little hideout. If people don't know we're here, I guess. If we're not being followed. Alright. Almost there. Here we are, gentlemen. Home sweet home. Yeehaw! Alright. You were wrong, Jose. This place is we perfect. I hope so. Gentlemen, we have survived. For now. Now it is time to prosper. Arthur and I were about to prosper in Blackwater. We were onto something big. Then Micah got you all excited about that ferry, and here we are. We have all made mistakes over the years, Jose. Every last one of us. But I kept us together. Kept us alive. Kept the nooses off our neck. I guess I'm just worried. I ain't got that long, Dutch. I, I want folks safe before I go. Me too. And now we are stuck. East of the Grizzlies and out of money. And a, a long way from our dream of virgin land in the West. I know, my brother. But we are safe. We make a bit of money here. Then we move again. Head out around them. Be west of Uncle Sam. In a few months, buy some land. I hope so. Would you just look around you? This world has its consolations. <laughs> Gentlemen, I'm going to head into the local town and, uh, you know, see if I can strike up a little business. Of course, Herr Strauss. I prefer robbing banks to usury. Seems more dignified somehow. Now, everyone! Put your tools down for a moment. Come on, gather around. Quickly now. I know that things have been tough, but we are safe now, and we are far too poor. So it is time for everyone to get to work. Get to work, but stay out of trouble. Remember, we are itinerant workers. Laid off when they shut down our factory to the north. Now get out there and see what you can find, Uncle. Reverend Swanson, no more passengers. <laughs> it is time for everyone huh? to earn their keep. There is a town a little way down the track named Valentine. Livestock town, all mud and morons, if I remember right. <laughs> that seems a decent place to start. And, uh, we need food. Real food. That means every day. 
One of you. And remember, whatever it is that one you person? find, one person, the camp gets its slice. Oh God. Now be sensible out there. Now the girls have your tent ready, Mr. Morgan. Come with me. You two will be ready shortly. We put you over here. I'm sure everything will be fine, Miss Grimshaw. It should be. Most of your stuff from Blackwater got saved. Everything apart from my money. Oh, don't remind me. Well, hmm. we can always make more money. We're gonna have to. Miss Jackson, right. I've sleep seen shape change clothes. Common sense than you do it properly. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, trying to read. She's being funny. Or store weapons in the weapon locker at your tent. Right. Chapter 2. Horseshoe Overlook. Alright. Play through a whole chapter already. Jesus. Couple of weeks later. Back in the mud. Let's go. <sighs> That view. Got off the mountain and rode east into some pretty enough country called the Heartlands. Very pretty. Ain't been this far east in many a year. Dutch seems a little better. His eyes are sparkling once more, and I can see he's thinking a little clearer. Isn't our beard we all feel beard a longer? Happier, in spite of black water and that whole mess. Right there. All right. Jose. <sighs> yeah. <laughs> Quite a day. Let's hope so. There's a bunch of the boys already in Valentine. Bill, Charles, and Javier. And Swanson found something down at the train station by the lake, apparently. And Strauss came back with that creepy little smile on his face. I'm sure there's a whole list of unfortunates he's forced money upon. <laughs> Thank you. And you? I'm gonna read a book. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Compendium updated camera. Your beard is getting long. I thought so. I can shave it? <gasps> shave. Ooh. Time. Trim. Oh, oh, it's like th four out of ten. Hmm. Should we go for a mustache? How do I? Oh, oh, like that. Okay. Ah. I see. Do we want a mustache? Do we? <laughs> Do we? Okay, let's go for the mustache for now. I love it. <laughs> okay, to love it. <laughs> All right. Let me have a look at you. Oh yeah. Now that's a cowboy. Ah oh, yeah. <laughs> All right, guys, I am going to go ahead and end this part here. I'm really, really enjoying it so far. Um, so far, I really like all the characters, the dynamics, the voice acting, like everything. And the world in itself is absolutely beautiful. And I can't wait now that we are in Chapter 2, Horseshoe Overlook. I can't wait to just go and explore. There's like a town called Valentine. Uh, so I think we're gonna go there. Sounds like we have uh, some quests going on. Yeah, I'm gonna try take my time uh, with everything. Go and have a look. Gather supplies for the camp. Um, I don't know how I'm gonna necessarily do these videos because I could easily record for five hours or something and then need to edit that down because time just flies by. Like this is already like two and a half hours. Um, and that's just the intro to everything. You know, we also need to, I already said it, collect um, supplies, uh, go hunting maybe, and you know, also try and keep up with all the characters and stuff like that. So I know it's gonna be a very long playthrough. I'm really, really gonna try my best to find and explore as much as possible, but with how massive the world is going to be, it's just not gonna be possible to find every single thing. So I'm sorry in advance if 
I miss something uh, or something important. I don't know. But I hope you guys have enjoyed this first part. I'm gonna try and have at least one episode a week, but I can't promise anything. Um, I'm hopefully building a new PC very soon because mine is three or four years old. So I'm when it, I am running on a 1060 GPU. I think that's what it's called. <laughs> uh, like the graphics card, a 1060. So it, or a 1080. I can't remember. So it's very outdated and I don't know how it's even keeping up um, with everything I use it for now. So hopefully that's going to help a little bit with uh, editing and, and just everything in general. There might be a bit of a slowdown on everything depending on how <laughs> that's going to go with the PC. Yeah, but I'm very excited. I really hope that this game is going to be what I need um, right now with everything that's going on in my life. I really hope that you guys are going to enjoy this series. But anyway, thank you so much for watching. I'd really appreciate it if you leave a like on the video and subscribe to my channel. I also stream over on Twitch and you can follow me on Instagram and Twitter. And if you want to support my channel even more, you can check out the links in the description down below. That is all from me for now. So bye and take care.